My name's Mark Stewart. I'm the chairman of Ballard's Bar. When you first pitched to DuPont, you said, pay us what, what we're worth, and that was in the 90s. We had no relationship with that company at the time. Our then chairman uh, was on a, served on a board with the, the, the DuPont General Counsel, and uh, I just implored uh, his friend to give us a shot, and I think it was perfunctory. And DuPont at the time said, you know, we want to we want to look for a different relationship, and we're looking for this, and we wanted this, and we want this, and we said, here's the proposal, just pay us whatever you want. Even they were stunned uh, at that because it was radical at the time. That sort of grows out of what's still growing out of our approach uh, as a firm today. I mean, we we listened to that client and they said, we want to do something differently. We also knew as a law firm that we couldn't just repeat what every other law firm was saying. We needed to stand out. We needed to come to a unique solution for a client, one that the client hadn't necessarily heard before. And luckily for us, the client had heard that before, but was actually so impressed with it that they said, all right, whether or not we do that arrangement, we know we're at the right firm because we know what their approach is going to be. We'll still do that arrangement for, for some clients, and we've done it in modified ways. What is your outlook for the market generally now? What do you see? On the economic front, I think it's still going to be tough for firms. We see competition coming from all over the place. I mean, and, and we, we have our sights set on work that we haven't been able to get before. If clients are, uh, companies are sincere in, in, in their willingness to try alternative ways of, of, of giving out work, we're there. If they're looking for a, a way to um, reduce their costs, even in their most complicated e matters, even in their most important mergers and acquisition deals, we want to be part of that conversation. So with, I see that's, I don't see that changing. I think there's going to be uh, continued pressure and competition on the financial side. And I also see um, more and more insistence that firms recognize the importance of diversity and inclusion in their business and help clients in their, in, in their business. Firms like ours are committed to having diverse teams of lawyers on all our client matters and, and we're actively out there recruiting diverse lawyers. I think there will be pressure on firms like ours um, to compete not only with firms that look like us, but different kinds of firms, virtual law firms, firms that specialize in discovery, firms that do work overseas. You're seeing the competition coming from areas where you hadn't previously seen it coming, as well as from the law firm down the street. Uh, where it's all going to shake out, I don't know.